Harry is revealed taking mushroom chocolate while staying at Courtney Cox's house in Los Angeles in his memoir Spare. Harry wrote that he went to the Friends actress's house after a party where he took psychedelic drugs. Harry recalled that at the time, Cox was apparently travelling on a job and didn't mind if we crashed at a place. The Duke said that as a Friends fanatic, the idea of crashing at Cox's house was highly amusing. Harry referenced Friends characters Monica Geller, played by Cox, and her on-screen husband Chandler Bing, played by Matthew Perry, and explained, I was still confused because she was Monica, and I was a Chandler, and I wondered if I'd ever work up the courage to tell her. Was there enough tequila in California to get me that brave? Harry claimed that while at Courtney Cox's home, he spotted a huge box of black diamond mushroom chocolates that were for everyone at the house party. My mate and I grabbed several, gobbled them, washed them down with tequila, he wrote. He recalled the time saying, my delightful trip had been his hell, adding, how unfortunate, how interesting. Harry's come under fire for dragging Courtney into this when it's apparent that she didn't even invite Harry into her house. Harry implied that Courtney has a stash of drugs in her house when she wasn't even there when he got high. It could have belonged to anyone, and people were quick to call him out for his revelation. One person commented, She wasn't there. It's like he implies they're friends, pun intended, but it's more like via their people. Sure, you can crash there, whatever. He then snoops through their stuff and steals her mushrooms. Is this what happened? Imagine this was you, having a friend of a friend stay at your place while you're out of town. They go through your stuff, use some of your private things, then put it in a book for public consumption years later. The second said, no, he's not Chandler. He's not Daenerys Targaryen either. He's a weak, peevish, real-life adult man of almost 40, not a TV character. He's been spending too much time with the actress who wanted life as a Disney cartoon, but got actual British history instead, and was expected to understand that because she isn't a toddler. Another added, leave Monica alone. This is extremely damaging to Courtney Cox's reputation and makes her a huge target for Hollywood. You don't stay at someone's house and accuse them of giving you drugs. Even though we all know it's the Hollywood lifestyle, you just don't do that. People have been kicked out and banned from Hollywood for this. He could have said an actress, but no, he had to name drop. What a way to alienate the exact group of people you're trying to make your friends. Others hope Courtney Cox sues Harry for millions with one saying, do you think she could sue him? as well as the publisher for including her without permission or right to respond. It's an invasion of privacy. No A-lister will open their house to him now. Why'd the fact checkers allow this to happen? Is this another Megan move? Did Courtney Cox snub Mimi a long time ago? Maybe Megan has a grudge against Courtney Cox. We can see that Mimi name drops and also puts people she hates in a bad light. 